Hello, my name's Stuart Parker and welcome to Parker Furniture Workshops. I've been a joiner cabinet maker for over 25 years and I hope this video helps with your DIY project. I'll show you how to use an electric wood planer. This machine simply planes the wood from sawn finish to fine. Mainly using doors, you can plane the edge of the door off. In wider pieces like this, you could do it, but you will get a series of lines which will need some sanding out afterwards. There are many on the market, but this is one of the best on the market at the moment, which we like here in the shop. You can set the blade by a knob on the front or sometimes at the top. They normally go from one millimeter up to 4.5. The majority of the DIY ones go up to about two and a half millimeters, which is very important not to take too much, too much off in one hit. You couldn't use this plane and then leave it unfinished. You'd have to sand that. But basically, simply to use the machine, it planes wood and wood only. Do not attempt to plane metal with this as it is extremely dangerous. So before we carry out some use of it and a little bit more talk on it, just remember one thing. So always wear your safety goggles and your safety mask. As you can notice when I've finished, I put it on its side. Do not put it straight down on its, on its face, especially on metal, as you'll damage the blades. That will give me a pretty good finish now, and I can sand that and that'll be perfect. As you can also see, there was a lot of debris came out at the bottom and the sides. You can buy dust extraction kits for these, and they're particularly useful, particularly when using them in the home. As a DIY novice, I wouldn't advise you to use one of these unless you've been shown how to use it by a professional. They are extremely dangerous, but extremely good when you can get the hang of them. That's how you use an electric wood planer.